Hey guys, welcome to TCR. Sid here, thanks for clicking on the video. If you haven't done so already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. God, they get loud when I come over here. Rogue chicken, are you stuck? Did you sneak again? This one keeps sneaking over the fence. Come on, come on. No, oh, no, 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 no. I don't have time for your shenanigans. This is not going well today. All right, come on chicken, we're going this way. Chicken, come on. No, stay. Chicken, you know what? Chicken. I can't. Come on, go. Jesus, God, unbelievable. Hey guys, welcome to TCR. Sid here, thanks for clicking on the video. If you haven't done so already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Today I wanna to talk to you guys about why you might wanna ferment some of your animal's feed. I used to be able to get some spent grain from a friend of mine that, that had a hookup at a distillery. Well, I haven't been able to get that for a long time and I had been hesitant to try to do it myself. Well, because of the new kinds of feed I was getting that comes in these big barrels that I'm storing them in, I decided to try and go ahead and try fermenting the feed myself. So I'm gonna talk you guys through what I did, tell you how well it's working. One of the nice things about fermenting your grains for your animals, it helps preserve the vitamins in your grain and can also create new ones like vitamin B, folic acid, and niacin, which of course is great for your ducks. Fermenting your feed for your chickens is great. They are less picky, I find, and they don't care uh, one way or the other but it's definitely fills them up faster. It's easier for them to digest and they tend to waste less of it. There's no dust. There you go. There's no dust that you're kind of losing some of that feed that way with waste. And so it kind of will help your feed bill in the long run because they're actually able to absorb more. They're actually able to absorb more of what they're intaking. It also helps to keep them hydrated on the hot summer months as well. So the fermented grains, for those of you that do feed your goats some grains, it's really easily digestible for them, which means they're able to absorb it and they have less waste. They will also fill up faster just like the chickens, which means that they won't go through as much feed. Fermenting your feed for your animals takes about three to four days for it to ferment properly. You wanna keep it in a container that has a loose fitting lid, it doesn't have to be airtight, and you do wanna make sure you check on it every day while it's fermenting and stir it up really well. You also wanna make sure that you're only doing about a day, day and a half's worth of food for everyone. So depending on the amount of animals that you're feeding and how much you go through, you'll kind of might have to play around with it in the beginning to see how much they actually start eating because that fermented feed's only good for about a day or two. Beyond that, it starts to really sour and or can develop mold. So you definitely wanna keep an eye on it because you don't wanna feed your animals anything that's developed any kind of mold. And if it gets a little bit too sour, some of your animals might turn their nose up at it. So whatever amount of grain you're going to be fermenting, you do wanna make sure that you cover it with just a couple of inches of water and stir it up really, really well. So not only are you giving your animals more folic acid, more vitamin B, more riboflavin, more niacin, especially for your ducks, you're also going to be cutting down your food costs and they're going to be filling up faster and staying nice and hydrated. So if you're up for the challenge of fermenting your feed, you might wanna go ahead and give it a try. You might find that your wallet thanks you and your animals will be able to absorb more of the nutrients from their feed. Thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel and click the bell so you get the notifications. Really? Is that where we're sleeping? Suckus bird. <laughs>